Oh, the sweet, sweet taste of victory. Victory, my friends, is mine. And I'm just going to share a couple comments that crap me up. So let's watch this. So here's John Scott. He says, uh, I've wasted too much time arguing with stupid people. So John Scott is perpetual troll on the channel. And now he's giving up. He's wasting too much time arguing with stupid people. When they call you stupid, you've won. It's like when they call you racist, you've run, you've won. Because unless you are stupid or unless you are racist, you know, they're just literally scraping out the barrel. They got nothing left. They got nothing left. They're at their last stage. And that's what they do. When they are beaten, devastated, they're literally hiding under the freaking caves from which they skirt out of. They will call you dumb, racist, or something else. Check this out. <laughs> yeah, Scooby-Doo. Um, what's up, Chompy? And he says, don't bother. While Josh is an expert in the financial planning system, I never said I was an expert, he has fallen for a lot of the anti-science claptrap that such interwebs pushes. It's sad to see such ignorance going hand down. I don't care. Literally. And I chuckled at that too because that's exactly what John Scott says. Uh, I believe in keeping an open mind. That's what got him all, you know, his panties all awry because I said, uh, he says, I believe in keeping an open mind but not so open that your brains fall out. And I said, wow, I didn't know your mind is what kept your brains inside your head. Weird, because your mind is not a physical thing. Your brain is, <laughs> your head is. And that's where he said, it's just a matter of expression. I'm starting to argue with stupid people. Before they said, do your clients, let's see, do your clients know that you're a flat earth believing science denier? <laughs> well, for my clients to know that I'm a flat earth believing science denier, I would have to, be a flat earth believing science denier. Now, the funny thing is both these guys, this is why they lose because they're using consensus equating that with science. And uh, I hate to say it, man, that's a dumb argument to make. Notice the difference I'm making. I don't say they're dumb, cause I don't know. I don't know these people, don't care to know them. I just I laugh, they're silly, but I don't call them dumb, but they're making dumb arguments by saying you're anti-science. Or saying you're stupid or flat or I don't, flat earth or something. It's just whole thing's dumb. Again, it's dumb. Not that they are dumb. And that is a big distinction. Because when you have to go and say you are stupid because you don't agree with my viewpoint, that's <laughs> you lose, man. And I don't do that. I don't do that because it's fun to say, I'll draw you out. And the minute they say you're anti science, no. I'm anti consensus. Consensus ain't science, baby. And for those who you think that consensus equals science, man, I got a long list of consensus that led to many, many evil things happening. A long list. And if you think that's science, well, I got nothing for you, baby. I don't not want anything to do with you. Stay the hell away from me and my family. That's all I got to say about that. Because you would immediately send the jackbooted thugs on to me. If you could. And you know they want to. Deep down inside, they want to send the stormtroopers against their political opponents. This is what the a consensus is. Establish a census. A consensus. Why? To stomp out heretics. Because if you're anti-science, i.e. again, anti-consensus, you're a heretic. And you could be pushing ideas that could challenge the consensus. And we can't have that. We can't have that in modern society because consensus is all that matters. Literally, it's right out of 1984. <laughs> Whatever the party wants is what will be perpetrated in mass culture. It used to be we're fighting Eurasia, Oceania, whatever the hell it is. I can't remember. Well, no, no, those are good guys now. Now, these are the bad guys. Wait, wait no, 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 don't be anti science. What? I, but, but, huh? So when they start throwing these diatribes of you're stupid, you're anti-science, they'll put things on you that you don't ascribe to necessarily, flat earther, what else they say, you're a, uh, uh, a Muslim. I had a guy call me a Muslim the other day. <laughs> you know you win. And rega rega regal, whatever. Love, love it, man. Love it. Victory is sweet. Sweet. Don't call people stupid. Their arguments are dumb. That's okay. That doesn't mean they're dumb. Their arguments are silly. 
And they're probably actually probably and if you're making a silly argument, it's a good chance you're a silly person. But a silly person can be brilliant too, by all means. <sighs> What's that? Oh. Ooh, the taste of victory. Mm. Mm. Oh, that tastes good. Almost like a ribeye. Nice to see you. <laughs>